Are you tired of bloated libraries slowing down your project? If you find yourself sifting through unused methods and classes, you're not alone. Today, we're going to explore how to remove those unnecessary dependencies from your JAR file. I completely understand your frustration. It can be incredibly annoying to realize that your JAR file is packed with code you never use. This is a common issue among developers, and it can lead to larger file sizes and slower performance. Let's dive into the specific question at hand. One user recently asked, is there a way to remove any unused methods and classes from the dependencies I shade into my jar? This is a great question and one that many developers face. So why does this happen? When you shade libraries into your jar, they often come with a lot of extra code that you might not need. This can bloat your application and make it harder to maintain. Understanding this is the first step to solving the problem. Stick around because at the end of this video, I'll share a powerful tool that can help you streamline your JAR files and keep your project lean. To begin removing unused methods and classes from dependencies, the user should first consider using a tool called ProGuard. This tool helps in shrinking, optimizing, and obfuscating the code. Next, the user needs to configure ProGuard in their project. This involves adding a configuration file that specifies which classes and methods to keep or discard. After setting up the configuration, the user should run the ProGuard tool during the build process. This can typically be done by adding it to the build.gradle file if using Gradle. Once ProGuard has been executed, the user should check the output jar file. It should now contain only the necessary methods and classes, significantly reducing its size. Finally, the user should test their application thoroughly to ensure that no essential functionality has been removed during the shrinking process. Fun fact, did you know that the first version of Java was released in 1995? It's come a long way since then, but the challenge of managing dependencies remains a hot topic. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. This user advises caution when removing unused methods and classes from dependencies. They highlight that frameworks often use reflection, making it difficult to determine which code is actually needed. They also question whether the issue of excess code is a real problem or just an assumption. If there are no complaints from customers, it may not be necessary to reduce JAR content. Finally, they suggest checking your own dependencies first before trying to reduce the size of the jar. Here's a pro tip. Always review your dependencies regularly. Keeping your libraries up to date and removing unused ones can save you a lot of headaches down the line. And there you have it. By using tools like ProGuard or the Maven Shade plugin, you can effectively remove unused methods and classes from your jar files. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips and tricks to streamline your development process.